Shib Army, welcome back here. Do we still have some uh, bullish sentiment still around crypto after these last few days? We're going to try to tackle that a little bit. And uh, do we have bullish sentiment around SHIB in particular in this ecosystem? We have seen volume really pick up in the last few days across the board. Of course, all of this driven by Bitcoin crossing over 26,000 yesterday. Now, since then has dialed back. We knew that that would happen. We talked about that in our live stream yesterday. Eventually, you're going to get a pullback. You can't just go up forever, especially that quickly, right? When you go up that quick, you got to come down just as quick. So that's exactly what happened. We did retrace a little bit. Same thing here with Chip, down about 4% from its high uh, yesterday. But here in the last three months, this is the chart you're looking at in the last three months right there. And uh, overall, we've seen just some nice, steady growth. Remember this, guys, back in late December, before we turned the page to 2023, we were trading at 508, 508. And uh, we got all the way up to 4015, nearly doubled in price. If you look at that uh, end of December time frame to the beginning of February. Now, since then, we've dialed back a little bit, sitting right now at uh, 4011. And just recently, we dialed back into the 509 range. To me, this is the range where I like to add to my position. Anytime we drop that zero, anytime we go back to five zeros nine, I'm looking to pick some up. We seem to bounce off of that. Uh, there is some strong support right at that four zero one zero level. So keep that in mind. Anytime we dial back below it, that's where I'm looking to add to my position, at least one of my ship positions. Now, the ship market remaining strong right now as bullish sentiment continues to roll. We'll see uh, what's going to happen here with the feds, right? With the FOMC meeting, that's going to give us a lot of insight and intel. But the most recent SHIB price analysis still shows a bullish trend uh, in SHIB. And it's currently trading right now, as we mentioned, in those uh, low 11s. Now, recently, the crypto gained about 3 or 4% uh, in the last 24 hours. It's dialed back, pretty much given that right back here in these uh, you know, last 24 hours. The SHIB market cap still stands uh, right around $6 billion, uh, and that number has increased steadily. And again, that volume number is the one we'd like to watch because when that volume ramps up, that's a good sign. That volume is up right now to $459 million here in the last 24 hours. Market cap sitting right at $6 billion at the time of this recording. But we go inside uh, this chart over on TradingView. We could take a look at some of the technicals. And over on TradingView, uh, it's showing some sell signals here on the daily time frame, except when we look at the 100-day moving average. So there's some mixed signals here. A lot of this, again, is going to hinge on what happens to Ethereum, what happens to Bitcoin, where this overall market goes. Uh, but right now, SHIB kind of finding its footing, uh, maybe consolidating here. I think that would be a positive kind of way uh, you know, throughout this week just to kind of see some consolidation, uh, hopefully nothing crazy happens because we just had some crazy days of volatility. I'd be okay with a couple, you know, days of just sideways action. That's, that's a healthy kind of a chart pattern here after all this volatility we've seen in the last three or four days. So we'll see what happens guys. Keeping tabs on it for you as always, make sure you're subscribed down below. So you don't miss any content we put out. Also hit that notification bell because sometimes you don't get notified, but if you hit that notification bell, put all notifications on, you'll know every single time I post a new one, and you can check it out at your convenience. Appreciate you guys. Also, down below in the description, Bybit. If you're looking to trade crypto, best place to do so, Bybit. The link's down below. See ya.